crooked that way. What do you want? Like a house? Back with another vlog, not a whole week vlog. Try not to keep it too crazy for you guys. I hope it's not dusty. This thing has been dusty because it's been a minute. Um, been chaos. I actually want to record a five month postpartum like life update. I only have two minutes on here. Oh my gosh. Okay. I think I'm gonna do like a Friday and Saturday vlog. Or maybe Sunday too, maybe a weekend vlog, I don't know. I'm talking so fast, but I want to show you guys I just got the new iPhone. This was like an impulsive buy. Obviously, being like a content creator, influencer, whatever you want to say, I need a lot of storage. And I have 512 gigabytes right now, and this is a one terabyte, which is like the biggest that they have. So anyway, I want to do like an ASMR unboxing, so the quietest place I can get is my car. Which is why I always do car talk videos, so... We're gonna unbox this in the car really quick. It just got delivered. Um, it was out of stock, so I don't know how... I checked a few days later and now they're just in stock, but I'm not complaining, so. I'm excited though because tonight I think I want to do like put the Christmas tree up, do Christmas decorating with you guys and the kids and my husband. I got this like really big PR package um, that I'm going to show you guys so I won't say too much about it. But it's Grinch themed and Kyron accidentally saw it. I was going to wait until like he got out of school to completely show him. But he hasn't opened it yet so I know he's really excited when he gets home from school and I told him we'd put the tree up tonight. So... My son does not forget not a thing. He is so smart. I'm talking so fast, but guys, this month is so exciting. I also have a really exciting call for something that we're going to um, the third week or second week in November. I don't know. I have to check. I think the second week in November. Anyway, it's a lot going on, guys, so this vlog is going to be a lot, but a lot of good things. Let me be quiet. I need to stop talking so we can do this. I have, like, cords and stuff on the seat, guys. I'm a mess. Well, that was a lot shorter than I expected. <laughs> okay, so this is the iPhone 15 Pro Max, one terabyte because I have no, is it dead? I have no storage on my one that's 512 gigabytes. So this is it. And then this is a charger that it came with, which is like different than the ones they usually come with. So that's pretty cool. I have been like completely trying to purge our house, like get rid of stuff, donate things, ship things out to people. I like to ship kids old clothes to people that have kids that are like the same size. So that's what I'm doing, but it's just taking me a really long time because it's a lot to try to like divide it up and then like, you know, the shipping labels and all of that. But that's what we're doing um, today is just like a complete clean out day. I really want to shop and do other stuff, but I'm not because I'm trying to be smart and responsible. Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. So I'm like deep cleaning everything and getting all of our donation stuff together to try and get the house together before all the Christmas decorations go up because it's about to be a winter wonderland. Live from the bed. Um, I guess I'm kind of dumb because I did not realize how long it was going to take to transfer all of my data over from my old phone to this phone. Sorry, my eyes so itchy right now. Hi. Yeah, I did not realize how long that would take. Isn't it crazy? I just was looking at my YouTube and I'm like, I feel like I just posted my birth vlog and now he's almost five months. Yeah. Literally probably by the time this is up, it will be five months and that's just insane to me. Right? <laughs> right now I'm just getting all caught up in everything I have to do to submit to like brands and stuff. So I am, I'm cracking up with this angle stuff to brands, doing creative concepts, um, sending in all of the like proof stuff. I say um a lot. Anyway, I was trying to say, they're literally just like school projects, so. You know, I work really hard on the ads that I do just because I always want them to be like super authentic to me. That's why this year, I was going to get into a whole brand. I turned down a lot of things this year just that don't align with me, um, my brand. So if you guys have noticed that I've been posting a lot less ads lately, it's just because I've been a lot more careful this year on like who I choose to partner with. Even if the brand does align with me, the brand has to also value me. And I also just want to partner with more brands that know what my audience likes, knows and trusts what I do as far as like creative um, concepts and stuff like that. Just knowing like that I know what to do, so giving me more freedom. And I completely understand like when brands do have like a specific 
concept and all that because I can still make it authentic but just making sure that it aligns with me so I've been turning down a lot of things that don't align with me but yeah it just feels good because I feel like I've turned down a lot but I also have gained so much more in like the ones that I have taken so I'm just really thankful my manager is the bomb so that's what we're doing right now and I don't know if I said this or not but yeah my phone is taking forever to transfer this laundry I'm about to dump out is all just the kids laundry my husband just left to get Kyron from school and London went with him. I have a call. He was going to take Weston too, but Weston will probably just cry because um, he already had a long nap. His laundry just gets dirty so fast and I wash laundry consistently. But basically, basically when I do laundry and I sort it, I'll put like my stuff um, in a pile, take that stuff in a pile, kids stuff in a like trash bag or a basket, and I'll bring it upstairs because their rooms are upstairs. So I'll let it like accumulate. I don't know. I try to do it as fast as possible. But it's just so much laundry to even put away like our stuff to begin with. So then their stuff is like so much that um, typically like they're always downstairs like playing and stuff. Doing a whole laundry room, getting so much laundry done. And now we have three kids that come with three times of laundry like it's honestly a joke. So I divided up Weston, London, and Kyron. And then I'm just going to keep going. And then once I get their stuff divided, then I can put it into piles of like pajamas, hang up stuff, pants, all of that. And um, what do I do after that? Oh, and then also stuff that doesn't fit them anymore. Then I'll put that in a separate pile. But for now, we're just getting it sorted. That actually was not honestly as bad as I thought at all. So I'm about to like go put the stuff in their rooms and then that's kind of what takes a lot of time is when like after I put it in their room trying to put it away from there. So excited. My husband and Kyron, my son, are at my warehouse right now getting the Christmas tree because it was so big that it took up like so much space in our garage. So he put it in my warehouse because I have like storage area there. So that is where they are right now. So that ankle's terrible. So I got pajamas for all of them. I'm just getting that laid out until they get back and try to like clean up the area where the tree will be. So there are the pajamas. 2T for London, 12 months for Weston, even though he's obviously way, way younger than that. 4T for Kyron, and I'm so excited. Where did I get these from? I think Target. Um, I'll link these for sure. Of course, Weston is knocked out. I'm trying to get vlogs on the front for TikTok, but. Oh, no. This is priority. Mm -hmm. It's okay. It's okay. I don't know if they scheduled for his team or not. Good job, Kyron. Mm -hmm. Mario, will you take this stuff out? Christmas. Where are you going to break? You're going to help me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You guys ready to help me? So, this is C, so we need one of the big bags over here now. Let's have you that I remember.
Grinch gingerbread house. Yeah, now we're gonna open it up. Ready? We gotta squeeze it to mix it. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Yes. First, we have to put a square on the house. Oh, he's nervous. on TikTok is basically like a cast iron skillet with um, the rice aroni and then you bake the chicken. Basically, long story short, it's going in the oven. So, let's try it and see how this is. I'm going to try to cook more, but mm, just depends on my day. But even though the house is destroyed because we did the gingerbread cookies, the hot chocolate bombs, all of that, the tree, um, I'm just happy because Last year, our fireplace was not working. And all of a sudden, now it's working, like at the end of winter. So I didn't really care because it was like the end of the winter, but it is suddenly working again. And I'm just really happy the tree is up because, you know, when it's like the new season, I feel like that's always like something daunting that's in the back of your mind is like putting up the tree or like doing something that's big, especially this big of a tree. But it was actually a lot easier than I expected. I don't know, but. Yeah, here is being made. I'm literally sitting here thinking about how beautiful this looks and like how special it is. Because the one thing I'll spend money on is stuff that will make memories for my children. Like, yeah, that's me. Like, and this tree will last forever. Yeah. So, um, if you guys are thinking about getting a nice tree, do it because it will last. Um, I'm definitely the type that pulls out all my decorations from the year before. I don't know where people say that from, or if people actually do that, completely just buy everything brand new every year, you're insane. <laughs> so yeah, just like building things that will make memories for the kids. And then, um, I should have made a YouTube video on it, but the kids actually made this, this textured art. It's just so beautiful, like, I just love it. And I'm so glad that I ended up doing something that the kids made, like it makes it so much more special in here. So yeah, I want to make some more artwork around the house for the kids, but yeah. It was so warm inside tonight. It's so cool already. And it literally has to be, it's like, like, mmm, let's put it up. 
I literally always forget to record and end to my videos. I don't know why, it's just always so hard to say goodbye. But anyway, like I said, back to being consistent. I'm so excited. And then the next video, I think it's going to be like, I was just trying to go to the bathroom. But my next video will be like a trip prep leading up to the trip that weekly vlog. Like I said, it's a brand trip that I'm really excited about. So be sure to follow me on my other like platforms for when I'm not on here. But thank you guys for being here. I'm so excited to be back.